Welcome guys, I'm Luigi Helli, System Engineer working for Powersoft. We are here doing our roadshow, uh, UK and Ireland roadshow, we're here in Belfast uh, for our X-Series launch. And in this video we will demonstrate um, some fancy things and dangerous things that you can do with your X-Series amplifier. Actually, uh, please don't do this at home. We have a very special cable, which is this one. This is speak on outputs to mains connector of the X series. And you see in the screens that we are running a 50 Hz tone from our X8 amplifier. Now I want to plug this cable, my very stupid cable, on the back of the X8 amplifier and I will feed the, the output of the amp straight into the X4 amplifier trying to boot it up and as you can see the amplifier it's working perfectly um, I wanted to do this because now I can change the frequency of the sound wave that I'm supplying to the amplifier. We are running now a 50 Hz sound wave, as you may see from our measurement software. I can change the frequency. Uh, the amplifier will accept from DC up to 400 Hz mains without manually configuring anything so I will now go towards 400 this is 60 Hertz mains so US mains powering we are going upwards 100 Hertz mains power 120 200 Hertz powering our X4 amplifier all up to 400 Hertz mains powering which is very very uncommon to say the least you won't find this anywhere but the amplifier really doesn't care at all we can go the opposite direction Let's go back to 50 Hertz. This is once again 50 Hertz. This amplifier will go down to DC. This is 8 Hertz mains powering our X4 amplifier. Even my measurement software is struggling a little bit to show you the, the frequency. 5 Hertz mains you can see the metering pulsing this is no more almost a continuous signal it's uh, a series of pulses powering our amplifier um, this is also showing how stable is this amplifier uh, down to 5 Hertz so it's really a work horse it's really uh, very very strong amplifier uh, with very strong output stages we can achieve this level of performance because our power supply it's reconditioning the power that it gets in and it has full stack of capacitors uh, that are acting like a tank of energy to keep the output stages and the DSP alive So thanks for your attention and see you in the next video.